Jesus, not forsaken mm -hmm. the assembling of ourselves together as the man of son is, mm -hmm. but exalting one another and so much the more as you see the day approaching. Some folk only realize and look at that point as being for the end come. Look at that point when Jesus just split the sky. But let me tell you, my brothers and sisters, every time you turn on your TV, every time you turn on your radio, pick up the newspaper, you can see the day is approaching.
survive in a most difficult time. They need to know how to call on the Lord and turn the plate down and know that God is a Jehovah Nisi God. He will prepare. Is approaching. The word says, This is a command, not a suggestion. God, God didn't suggest that you should go, He is commanded. Don't forsake gathering ourselves together. Christian should assemble together for worship of God. Not only to worship God, but to encourage one another. Oh, you don't hear me. Uh, I remember when we used to go to church and they would have what they call a testimony service. Help me somebody. I may not finish this today, but I got to get a few things in. And they would have somebody uh, to stand up in the corner. And they would tell how the Lord had been good to them. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> they would tell about and their children would almost go astray. And God protected them. And somebody else on the other side of the church who are facing some difficulty. Hallelujah. They will lift up holy hands. They thank you, Jesus. They feel the vibration of the Holy Spirit. Somebody realize that everything it's going to be all right. Yes. We don't have time for testimony services anymore. Testify means encourage each other. It's sure that my brother or sister, you're not the only one with the problem. You're not going through difficult time alone. We all got some situations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it had not been for the hand of God. Yes. We would not make it. We ought to encourage each other to warn ourselves of the sin and the danger of backsliding. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know it's very easily for me to point my finger at somebody who has stopped coming to church. But if we understand this text, this text says, assemble together. So you can warn yourself and others that you're just one step. Help me somebody. Yeah. You ought to high five somebody. Yeah. And tell them you're only one step from backslide. Don't look at me strange. You only one step from backslide. That's why we have come together. That's why we assemble ourselves. Yeah together to warn ourselves of the sin and the danger of backsliding, to keep ourselves and our fellow Christians mindful of our duty, of our failure. Hallelujah. If we didn't come to church, if we had come to church, we can encourage each other. How easy it is to stay home when the weather doesn't look favorable. And when the rain stops and the sun shines, now it's too hot. Come on, somebody. We need to constantly warn ourselves how easy it is to backslide.
Israel. Have to find excuses. Be mindful of our failures and our corruption. To watch one another, over one another, godly. For the day is approaching. Point two says, God, help me, against the matter of self. Mm -hmm. God yourself. Now that you've heard this message, the next rainy Sunday, hey, the next rainy prayer meeting night, you remember to guard yourself against the behavior of some. That we will not fall into the same path. Yeah. Yeah. Is that God against the manner of some? Yeah. Verse 27 is not forsaking ourselves together as the man of some is, but exhorting one another, and so much is the more as ye see the day approaching. Hallelujah. For if we sin willfully, uh -huh. after that, yeah. we have received. Yeah. If we sin willfully, yeah. after God has saved us, uh -huh. after he has forgiven our sin, yeah. Yeah. if we sin by being disobedient, yeah. if we sin by not keeping his commandment. We have received the knowledge of the truth. There remaineth no more Jesus to come. There remaineth no other word to come. Jesus has already come. Yes, yes. Gone to the cross of Calvary and told us that we believe in him. Yes, yes. As the scripture says. Out of our belly uh -huh. will flow the rivers of water, which represent the spirit yes. of God. Yes. Will represent our happiness yes. when we feel disappointed, when we feel forsaken. Yes. If we remember that Jesus died yes. Yes. on Calvary, yes. oh glory to God. We must remember, my brothers and sisters, and be felt for the look for the judgment. For the judgment is coming. And the Bible says that the devil and all of his followers will be cast into the lake of fire. The lake of fire is simply mean hell. Let me tell you, nobody has to go to hell. Right. Nobody, nobody has to go to hell. Did you say that if anybody tell you to go to hell, you just simply say, hell? No. No, I didn't swear. I just said, no, I will not go to hell. All right. Nobody has to go to hell. Right. Mm. The Bible says, 2 Thessalonians, verse 2 and 3, chapter 2, verse 3, let Follow after me. If you don't have your Bible open, let no man deceive you by any means. For that a day shall not come 